Welcome back to the kitchen again with Chef Ricard of Cooking Show. It's amazing to be in the kitchen giving you your favorite recipes, ideas, and things where you want to make at home. This time, I want to show you how you can make yourself a nice, lovely red wine lamb. All right, I'm going to be marinating the lamb from today. I'm going, I want the lamb to soak with a lot of garlic, white onion, and I even have a little bit of fresh rosemary and some fresh thyme, spring onion. I'm going to marinate it up getting the flavor when i'm going to be cooking it you will see exactly what chef record have been talking about so this one which i'm going to make today i'm going to show you first thing you need to marinate the lamb for at least 24 hours or 12 hours all right just wash off my lamb into some lemon juice i know the lamb put to rest just ready to soak ready to marinate so first of all I just cut up half of a white onion I'm not gonna put that first I want to get the garlic I got four cloves of garlic which I'm going to be using inside of it so I'm gonna just crush my garlic because I'm already removed the skin from the garlic all right lovely and nice and I want to use a four cove of garlic. So four cove of garlic on the lamb. And all I have to do is just get the garlic crushed in. Ready to put on the lamb. And get in the flavor from the garlic towards the lamb. It's going to be amazing. Nice one. Yeah, the garlic smells so lovely and nice. So, that's the four clove of garlic. I just rub up, just put on the lamb. So what we're going to do next is this, is make sure you guys got gloves, very important for when you're marinating your meat. You got a lot of gloves, and you know what I mean? Yeah, so make sure the garlic go all over the lamb. That's exactly what you want to do. This is some steak lamb. But I'm going to do a red wine lamb. It's going to be an amazing one. I'm going to show you how to cook on this inside of the pot. Lovely. Alright. So. That's the garlic over the lamb. This is some fresh thyme. It's going to be simple. Broke up the fresh thyme on it. I got some rosemary. We're just gonna do a simple break that lovely rosemary and the lamb and get in that flavor. Look at that, lovely and nice. Two pieces of spring onion. And I put a little bit of pepper. The only thing I must say to you, if you have lamb season, please use your lamb season. At the moment, I don't have any lamb season. I can't believe, but I got some season which I'm going to be using. I'm gonna put a little bit of Cajun season on it. All right. Roughly about a teaspoon of Cajun season. And I'm gonna be using the Jamaican Valley All Purpose Season. I'm gonna put a teaspoon on it. Let's put a little bit more on it. Nice one. And I got half of a white onion, which I'm already cut up. I'm gonna pop that straight inside of it. Lamb, you don't need to put oil on lamb, but I'm true, I'm marinating it for 24 hours. I'm just gonna put a pinch of oil and it's not too much. You can you use your favorite oil? What you wanna use? Olive oil or coconut oil? which is even healthy so now we're gonna do simple rub it up like this oh man this smell lovely and nice so this is exactly what me attack up right here just take a good look you see it look nice already all right so what you want to do, you want to get this to soak and ready for 24 hours. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to simple 
leave it in my bowl and get this ready and soak for 24 hours and I'm gonna show you my fans them how you can make yourself a nice lovely red wine lamb how to cook your red line red wine lamb at home it's gonna be an amazing recipe please follow me on Instagram and Twitter Facebook Google plus me and get your favorite recipe so first thing we want to do you want to marinate the lamb get it soaked get it ready and after you're gonna show you how to cook it that's the best bit of how to cook the lamb all right guys so stay tuned and thank you so much for watching